Here goes nothing. Hey everyone! So, we're doing the mohawk. I couldn't wait for a thousand subscribers because it is so, so hot. Like, 81 degrees, no wind hot, freaking humid, moist, wet when you walk outside weather. And my hair is not a fan. I hope I like it. If not, whatever, it's just hair, it'll grow back. Okay, I'm recording. So, anyway, here we go. I've sectioned my hair out. I gotta pull my bangs forward a little. Um, I did the best I could with no help because my husband's not home right now and when he left I said, would you care if he came back and I had a mohawk? And he looked at me and went, no. So, here we go. I have a smock. I should get my smock. I'll be right back. Okie dokie. I got my smock. It's not for me. Ooh. The smock is for my bed because this is the only place with a window and natural light and mirrors and my ring lights next to my vanity. So we're just gonna roll with it. And yeah, here we go. Again. Ugh. Okay, so we're gonna start with the already shaved side so that way if I chicken out, you know. And hopefully it goes a little better this time and the buzzer doesn't die halfway through the video. watering like a son of a bee. Hopefully I got that all in the video frame. Oh, I have hay fever. And it's hot in my room. And I forget to blink when I'm shaving the side of my head. Okay, so. One side down. <laughs> Am I gonna chicken out? Ooh, I hope not. My hair is gross. <laughs> oh man. That's what I use to do my eyebrows and whatever. It's just an old spoolie that I really liked and didn't want to throw away. And then they changed the physician's formula bottle. So I just kept an old one. Because they're rubber or whatever and they're easy to wash. Anyway, back to this. Oh my goodness. Will I regret it? I mean, I love my side shave. I guess there's only one way to find out. Ugh. Whatever, let's do this. Okay. I've sectioned my hair out already. I have my hair cutting shears that are pretty dull because I've had them for like five years almost and haven't sharpened nor replaced them. Let's make sure my parting is still how I want it. That's not the mirror I'm looking in. This is. Oh man. Well, I guess we'll see. Okay, here we go. Let's just do this. Here goes nothing.
Okay, it looks fairly even. I mean, for how I wanted it. Because I did make this side a little bit thicker so it would cover more over here. See? This one doesn't quite do that. This one I wanted to. I'm going to thin it now. Ooh, I'm sweating. Okay. Try and thin it with me super dull. Yeah, that's not going to work. I'm going to have to go old fashioned here and slide cut. I have a razor downstairs that I don't want to go find. Ow, these are more yanking. I might have to go find it. But yeah, anyway. Time to take it out of, ugh. So covered in hair. My floor is carpet, so yeah, that's nice. Take it out of the thingies. stuff. Yeah. Bobby pants. Okay. So I think I'm going to try and cut it now on the same day. I just washed it quick and towel dried it with a 100% cotton cloth or a baby blanket, like a burp, rag, swaddly, thin one. They work really well. So I watched a video about round layers, and I think that's what I'm gonna wanna do, is round layers. Because when you, when you cut round layers on a mannequin and you hold the head upside down, it's round. If that makes sense, that's why they're called round layers. It's because it goes with the head shape. So if I'm doing a mohawk, I think it would be nice to do round layers because it would go with the head shape, you know? And I kind of want it all to be the same length from top to bottom. I've only cut a mohawk one time. I'm gonna try something different because this round layer idea isn't working.
love you. You like it? Yeah, it's good. Touch it. Dude, there's a mohawk here. Show sure dad. I did. Show him again. I already did. I'll show him again in a minute. I love you. Uh, you know, Trevor, it's supposed to be bad storms again tonight. Starting at like 3 o'clock, it's going to start kicking up here pretty soon.